during this year of mercy, and actually we at the Franciscan University started celebrating the year of mercy at the beginning of this academic year, we've already begun to see some of the fruits of that, uh, with so many of our households, our students getting very involved uh, in celebrating the corporal works of mercy, reaching out uh, to our brothers and sisters in need and being the presence of Christ to them. But it also gives all of us, each and every one of us, an opportunity to be merciful to others, but through that process to come to know and understand and be able to better embrace God's mercy for each of us in our own lives. Dearly beloved brothers and sisters, the Holy Father on this solemnity of the Immaculate Conception has inaugurated an extraordinary jubilee, thus opening to us and to all men and women, the door of God's mercy. Crossing through that threshold, walking through that holy door, again, is not a Kodak moment, but it is meant to be a moment of conversion for when we walk through that doorway, we ask ourselves, how may we better exemplify the mercy of Jesus in our lives? during this year of mercy. Um, we would encourage people to come to this pilgrimage site to cross through the holy doors, not just as a rite of passage, uh, but to also experience that power of conversion in their lives, uh, being able to embrace God's mercy, God's forgiveness, but allowing that to transform their lives in the way in which uh, they continue to live their lives, not only following in the footsteps of St. Francis, but following in the footsteps of Christ as well.